Just to our south, moderate risk of severe weather. That could slide its way just a little bit north. We're going to still be in a warm sector here, and that's going to bring in some south southwesterly winds still and still warmer temperatures. So open up those windows, get outdoors, go for a walk this evening. It is going to be a fantastic evening. We saw a couple severe thunderstorm warnings out by the Minnesota Wisconsin border. However, those storms have been dissipating throughout the afternoon. Good evening to you. Hope you're able to get outside and enjoy another summer-like day across southern Wisconsin. Temperatures got up into the upper 70s and lower 80s for the second straight day. Just unusually warm weather for this time of year. Unfortunately, that's going to come to an end with showers and storms passing through this evening. A much cooler day tomorrow, but the weekend looking absolutely spectacular. Doppler cam showing a lot more menacing clouds starting to push their way into the Madison area and currently in Madison still very warm at 75 degrees winds out of the west southwest at 8 miles an hour. Lows today a very warm start to put that in perspective. The average high across southern Wisconsin is 56 degrees. We were in the low to mid 50 to start out this morning. 53 in Madison, 59 in Janesville and Prairie du Chien out there. 62 degrees to start and then we were just off to the races upper 70s and lower 80s for highs across southern Wisconsin currently still very warm to areas south and east of Madison but to the north and west 65 in Baraboo 65 in Lone Rock rain cooled air starting to make its presence known and it has been a windy day too with gusts between 20 and 30 miles an hour here's the line of showers and, and few thunderstorms making their way through southern Wisconsin. See this rain out in Iowa that is also going to push in to southern Wisconsin later on tonight. Cold front is the catalyst for this. However, this cold front is going to cause dramatic change in temperatures, but for severe weather, we don't have to worry about anything like that. Just not enough moisture in the air to promote severe weather. Clouds start clearing out tomorrow. It's going to be another breezy day, but that's just going to allow high pressure to settle into the upper Midwest and make for an extremely pleasant weekend. Absolutely gorgeous. Temperatures for tomorrow, a lot cooler too, around 20 degrees cooler than we've seen the last two days. Forecast for this evening, scattered showers and thunderstorms. Temperatures drop from the 70s into the 60s. And then tonight, becoming partly cloudy, temperatures will drop down to a low of 50. Winds will shift to out of the northwest at 10 to 20 miles an hour. Tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny and much, much cooler high of 60 degrees, winds still out of the northwest, fairly strong at 10 to 20 miles an hour, but then Saturday, sunny and pleasant, high of 60 degrees, winds will be a lot lighter too out of the northwest at 5 to 15. Seven day forecast looking great for Sunday, the best day out of the weekend, mostly sunny skies, high of 60 degrees and light winds. The rest of the seven day looks great too with mostly sunny skies for a good portion of the week and temperatures remaining in the low to mid 60s. And a fine good morning to you. Happy Friday. We made it to the end of the week. If you take a look at what's ahead, one more warm day today, but a wet night tonight into early Saturday. Easter Sunday though, still looking good. Highs yesterday, look at this. 80 degrees or more across southern Wisconsin, 81 degrees in Madison. That is a record high for yesterday, 84 degrees in Watertown, the high point across southern Wisconsin. And look at these lows, didn't really drop off that much either. In the upper 50s and lower 60s, these are the warmest lows that we've seen on record across southern Wisconsin as well. So just an all out warm day and beautiful day yesterday. Roof cam showing more clouds moving in and that sun not shining through quite as much as we've seen the last couple of days. Temperatures on the rise in the mid to upper 60s. Like I said, just a very, very warm night. That was because of these southerly winds that have just stayed with us and stayed up all night around 10 to 21 miles an hour across southern Wisconsin. Nationally, looking at temperatures, very easy to see where that cold front is. 50s, 60s, and even 70s out to the east of the cold front, behind that cold front in the 30s and the 40s. Dramatic change in temperatures. Clouds and radar showing some showers and thunderstorms developing in the central plains ahead of that cold front. But behind that cold front, some snow showers in the Dakotas. They even saw some thunder snow earlier on this morning. Upper Midwest clouds and radar showing that rain moving into the southwestern portions of Iowa. That is the rain 
that is going to move through later on tonight. Not quite as heavy, not quite as severe, but rain showers nonetheless. Futurecast showing that low pressure system off in western Minnesota this morning. That cold front way off to the west. Go through the day. Showers start moving in by 7 p.m. across the western Wisconsin. With that cold front and most of the precip still way out to the west. Later on tonight, cold front moves through. Some, shower some showers of around a quarter of an inch early on in Saturday morning. But look at this, by 7 a.m., most of the rain is done in southwestern Wisconsin. Think that'll, I think the rest of southern Wisconsin will follow suit by the, by the afternoon. And that sun coming out in the, later on, in the later afternoon. And Easter Sunday, still looking great with partly sunny skies. Forecast for today, filtered sun and, and windy. Just a few showers late in the day off to the west, a high of 77 degrees. Winds out of the south at 12 to 25 miles an hour. Tonight, breezy with showers. Just a few rumbles of thunder, a low of 53. And then tomorrow, cooler with a few showers in the morning, but becoming partly sunny later on in the day. High of 59. Seven-day forecast looking great for Easter Sunday. 66 degrees and partly sunny skies. Monday and Tuesday, another round of rain. Cooling off by the midweek for Wednesday and Thursday, with temperatures still in the mid-50s, above average for this time of year.